Artists and wildlife professionals gathered last week in Sacramento to choose the best waterfowl art in California by children in kindergarten through 12th grade. Judges narrowed down more than 2,600 entries to come up with the winners in four grade categories and a best of show that will represent California in the Federal Junior Duck Stamp Contest on April 18th. California Waterfowl works with the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service to put on this competition each year. CWA staff and volunteers visit schools to teach students about wetlands and waterfowl biology, and they finish the program with a brief art lesson to get students going on their projects. The art they submit is like a visual term paper about what they learned. Last week, the judging took place in two phases. First, judges met at the Sacramento National Wildlife Refuge to narrow the field to the top 400 entries, 100 in each grade category. The second phase was held at the Crocker Art Museum in Sacramento, where judges participated in a rigorous winnowing process. They looked at fine details, counting feathers on birds' wings, and assessing whether the proportions of their bodies were exact. Some students who were finalists were in the room during judging, and they had to keep their emotions quiet so they wouldn't influence the judges. In the end, the winner was 15-year-old Jonathan Chen of Fremont, whose portrait of a pair of ruddy ducks met the judges' exacting standards. California consistently leads all other states with the number of entries it receives for the Junior Duck Stamp competition, and the state gets a dollar for each entry, which can be spent on conservation. States also get a share of the proceeds of duck stamp sales to be used for conservation education. But the most important thing is that the competition helps foster an appreciation for waterfowl in students who may not live anywhere near a wetland, and that can translate into thousands of new conservationists each year.